What's going on, gang? Matt here. Happy Wednesday, whatever day you're watching this. I'm going to kind of combine a Wednesday word with a piano tutorial. But the song talks about fear is a liar. I want you to think about your life. What is it that maybe even subtly you don't realize you are fearing today? You know, 1 John 4, 18 says, perfect love cast out fear. The Bible says God is love and, and perfect love cast out fear. When we have the Holy Spirit, like it says in Romans, the same spirit that rose Jesus from the grave lives inside us. When we have that inside us, we can't live a life of fear, whether it's COVID, whether it's craziness going on in our country and politics, whether it's financial stress, whether it's career stress, whatever it is, temptations, trials, heartaches, hardships, all this stuff, it's going to come. Jesus said that it will come. But when you have that perfect love inside you, you don't have to fear because you know the one who has the whole world in his hands is holding on to you too. I thought I would share that real fast, that perfect love cast out fear. Let that, let, just replay that in your mind as you go throughout the day while you're learning this song after this video is over. Perfect love cast out fear. We will not, as Jesus followers, live a life of fear. Now let's go learn this fun song. All right, gang, let's jump into the lesson here. This song's gonna use four chords. Now what I did, I marked the, the um, C note. If you, if you need to, if you're a beginner, find the two black keys, go one to the left. That's going to be your C note. So the, the three chords that are going to be super easy to play, first is the F chord. You play the F note, every other white key, and that's going to be your F chord. If you, if you have smaller hands and want to use your thumb, middle finger, and pinky, you can do it this way. I've said in other videos, the reason I will do it with, with these three fingers is I will often use my pinky and play a high F as well. So it's kind of makes the chords really rich and a full sound. But again, if you're just a beginner, just do that or that. So there's the F chord. For your C chord, just like an F, it's a C every other white key. Your next chord is going to be a D minor, a D minor, which is a D every other white key. So anybody can play those three chords, F, C, and D minor. Your fourth and final chord is going to be a little bit tricky. You're going to play your th uh, this right, this uh, B flat with your um, with your thumb, then a D and an F. So you might even want to put your hand, slide your hand up. But again, you're playing this one, this one, this one. So what I'm doing is playing my thumb, my first finger. That's going to be your uh, B flat chord. <coughs> so for example, I'll start with the chorus. Right there, I did a B flat for four, F for four, C for four, and I mean D, B, uh, B, D minor, and a C. So, fear is a liar. It'll take your breath, stop you in your steps. Repeat it. Then back to the B flat, cause fear. Two B flats, two C's. It is back to F. Liar. So that's what I always recommend is just use your right hand and learn those chords. So I, for for example, on this, I would learn just this B flat for four, F for four, D minor for four, and C for four. So those are the chords you're going to use on this whole song. Uh, so, for example, on the verse. So, again, just learn your right hand. We're going to work on the left hand in a second, but I want you all starting off with just that right hand. When he told you you're not good enough, B flat, told you you're not right, F. When he told you you're not strong enough, B, put up a good fight. When he, this D minor, told you you're not worthy, when he, B, told you you're not loved, F, when he told you you're not beautiful, B flat, never be enough. Stand at B flat. Fear is a liar. It'll take your breath. 
stop you in your steps. So again, once you learn that, what you're gonna do is you're gonna do the exact same thing with your left hand. So again, you'd play all the chords together. So what you do is called a rhythmic pattern, both hands together, then just your right hand. So for a four count, it would be one, two, three, four. So again, you do both hands. So, so you start with the B flat. I'm doing that. I'm doing both hands, right hands, both hands, right hand, both hands, right hand. Always learn that right hand first and get really good and comfortable, first of all, learning the chords. So you want to get comfortable going to F, C, D minor, and B flat. That's the first thing you want to do. Then you want to work on combining both hands together. Even if it's slow, one, two, three, four. And again, if you have smaller hands and you need to use your thumb, middle finger, that's fine too. Just make sure you're pressing the right keys. There's your lesson, guys. Thank you so much for checking it out. Go to my website, AcousticSelection.com. I got a beginner piano DVD. If you're just interested totally from scratch, you know nothing about piano you want to learn, go to my website, AcousticSelection.com. I got praise and worship song books on there, uh, beginner DVDs for guitar and piano, all that good stuff. Please smash the like button on the video and subscribe if you have it. I sure appreciate it. God bless you.